Hey guys, Future Gohan SSJ2 here. Uh, there's, well, this is another Cartoon Network slash Konami update. Um, for March 12th, 2012. And there's a lot of uh, stuff going on on the internet right now. Is Toonami coming back? Because there's supposedly been a tweet. I will link the tweet down below. Um, of, um... One of the guys that works, I believe, who works at Cartoon Network, I don't recall. His name's Andy something. And um, he said, he tweeted on, on Twitter, and he's like, um, you know, be checking on, on, on Cartoon Network on March 30th. That's all I can say for now. Um, so, uh, I think it may just be that, I think that's when... Um, it, but the reason why everyone's getting so crazy about Toonami is because Steve Blum mentioned in a, an anime podcast, uh, I don't know when it was, but I think it was recent, that, oh, we hadn't seen the last of Toonami, but that's all I could say for right now. Um, something along those lines. Um, and everyone's like, oh, well, it must be on March 30th. Uh, well, uh, to be honest, what I think is going to be on March 30th, um, it might be the, uh, the design change. Because if you guys remember, the from the um, from the video I showed you guys last time, uh, they're going to be changing the the promos and stuff to things that were more like the Cartoon Network city and and all that kind of stuff, which is going to be really amazing and like freaking awesome. Um, so for those of you guys who oh I've given up on Cartoon Network, you know, if you guys could just avoid the live action and watch everything else, I can guarantee you guys you guys will fall in love with Cartoon Network again. Because the reason why I I Fell, fell out of love with Cartoon Network for the longest time was because they changed the promos. They went to the check it style, you know, where, you know, what's the point of that? You know, but now that they're going back to, you know, as long as there's the nice style for me there, you know, I'll, I will feel, you know, like a kid again, you know? Like I just took a time machine and I went back to 2004 to the Cartoon Network City era, you know? Um... But yeah, a lot of people are thinking, and I don't know, I, I don't know what, what Steve Blum said when we said we haven't seen the last of Tsunami. From what people have been telling me, people have been telling me that he said, I, I haven't seen the actual podcast for myself, but just been getting a lot of word from people. And they, some people have said that, that he said that we haven't seen the last of Tsunami, but some people have told me that all he said was, um, uh, there's a few, there's a few things left of Tsunami, uh, and you guys will, will see that soon, or something like that. Just a few things left, so who knows what that could mean? Um, maybe a special appearance of Tom somewhere, you know, something like that. You, you don't you don't know what it means. You don't want to. You really don't want to jump the gun, and that's what everyone does every time. There's a small glimpse of tsunami. They're like, oh my god, he's on Fusion Fall. Oh my god, oh my god, he's on Fusion Fall. Tsunami's coming back. Nope, that didn't happen. Um, oh my god, Cartoon Network's uploading, uploading Tsunami clips onto the website! This is some hidden meeting! No, 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 I don't think so. I don't think so. Just because they upload, they're uploading old promos doesn't mean anything. It could mean that they're getting ready for something, but again, you really don't want to jump the gun with that. You really don't. Oh, but they uploaded promos onto the website. Oh, oh, Tsunami's coming back, right? Right? No, no, no. They're just uploading old promos onto the website. This is nothing new. This is nothing new. Um, yeah, so, guys, check out Cartoon Network on March 30th. I don't know what's going to happen. I think it's just a promo change, but um, it could be something else. Maybe the premiere of something. Um, but, yeah. On March 23rd, though... Um, I heard that it's going to premiere Ben 10, um, Destroy All Aliens. That's what I heard it's going to air. Uh, it just said, um, it says to be announced on Cartoon Network's schedule, but, um, you can, it, it just, um, everyone says that it's going to be Ben 10, Destroy All Aliens, so look out for that. Um, oh yeah, another thing, I was just watching Cartoon Network a while ago, um, and I did see a commercial for a, um, it, it was a it was a double commercial. Like it was advertising two things in one commercial. It was advertising the Ben 10 four pack, and it was advertising the Cartoon Network Hall of Fame collection four pack. I didn't get the chance to record that commercial, and I'm actually about to go downstairs and watch the more Dragon Boxes. But um, 
If anyone manages to catch that commercial uh, and record it, please upload it to YouTube because I think that's a really badass commercial. Um, it was talking about oh, over like a hundred minutes, I think it said, of classic shorts and stuff like that. And even for Ben 10, it has the first four volumes of Ben 10 in it. Um, and again, I don't know if these these this Hall of Fame pack has all the Hall of Fames or not. Because with the Ben 10 one, it has it has four Ben 10 DVDs in one. It is, and calling it the Hall of Fame collection really does insinuate that it's got all four Hall of Fames in one, but I really doubt that. I'm doubting that now because it's only like it's like only 600 minutes, I think, on the back of the box. Because that's what Amazon says the runtime is, it's like 600 minutes, and that's not enough for all three. Uh, so I think it, it might be just a compilation of uh, the greatest episodes on the season uh, Hall of Fame season sets. But I don't know. Again, I don't know. They haven't released anything on that. All, all they've released is a time and nothing else, you know. But again, if anyone manages to catch that commercial again, you know, I don't care if it's like halfway through or anything, just start recording it and upload it if you can. Because that was a really badass commercial. And then it's like, PM it to me. Don't freaking post a comment because, oh my god, I hate the comment section now. It's so freaking tedious to go there. Like, I, I, I only check my comments now like once a day. Because... Before, I could just go to my channel, scroll down, and then boom, there they are, you know. And I barely even go to my channel anyway. But now it's just, oh, so much more tedious, you know. It's just like, instead of, you know, going to your channel, just scrolling down, boom, there they are. You got to go to your channel, you got to click feed, you got to click on comments, and there they are, you know. It's, it's, it, it, it's, not, it's nothing, you know, oh my god, this takes forever, but it takes a lot more time than, than it did before. Before, I would just go to my channel, scroll down, and look, they were there. They were on my channel. You know, now I just have to go through all this stuff, you know, and it's I, it's just a lot more tedious now. And that, that's why I was telling everyone, please, if you want to contact me or you want to talk to me, don't post a comment. Because I really hate responding to comments. And if, and if it's something like, hi, or something like, what's up, you know, if you want to talk to me, Private message me if you want to have a conversation with me. Private message me. Don't don't try and have a conversation with me in the comments. There's a lot of people that like that like having conversations with me in the comments, and I really hate responding to comments. I really hate responding to comments because you have to worry about the length limit. You have to worry about all this other crap. Why don't you? Why do you do that? Why don't you just private message me? It's it's a lot less of a hassle for me, and and I can and I can talk to you guys more. So. Don't post a comment because unless YouTube changes this, and even then, it's it's still a ha it's still it's, you know because I have to go to the page, I have to click on your name, I have to go to a completely different page, I have to scroll down, go to your comment section, I have to type in a comment, and then I have to hit respond, you know, or I can just go into my inbox, see that I received a message, click on it, click respond, respond to it, you know, it's a lot quicker, it's a lot. It's a lot easier for me, and it'll be a lot easier for you too. You know, just go to my page instead of, instead of typing in comment, just go to my page and click send private message. But um, and I'm and I'm in, I'm in my inbox ninety percent of the time anyway. So, um, yeah, that's about all I really have to say. Watch out for Cartoon Network on the thirtieth. Um, don't forget on the twenty third as well. If you got if you are and it's gonna be classic Ben Ten too. Again, I don't know. If, I don't. I don't know if Destroy All Aliens, but that's just what everyone's telling me. Uh, Destroy the Aliens will be airing on tw on the twenty third. That's what I'm telling you. So, watch it on the twenty third. Like, if you don't like Alien Force or anything like that, don't worry. It's gonna be classic Ben Ten. Um, and yeah, look out for that promo change too. It, and if you're if you guys are one of those guys like, oh, I don't watch Cartoon Network that much anymore. You know, and I don't like this and that. If you guys could, the only thing to avoid now, really, honestly, is the live action. I mean, for God's sakes, they put Camp Lazlo and what's their Scooby Doo back on? I'm watching it right now. You know, I mean, for God's sakes, if you guys, look, Ed and Eddie's on at 2.30 and 3 o'clock today, I mean, Jesus, if you guys can, and if you don't like the new shows either, that's fine, whoops, that's fine, most of the early day is, is classic shows, so I mean, all the people that were whining, oh, they don't show classics anymore, they don't show classics anymore, they do show classics, just not later in the day, that's when they show most of their stuff, whenever, when all the kids are home from school, they're like, okay, let's show, let's show Mad, let's show Regular, let's show Adventure Time, but like since it's spring break, I'm I've been watching Camp Laszlo. It's ten o'clock in the morning. No, I, it, it came on at like nine, I think, nine thirty, and I saw Camp Laszlo. I'm watching What's New Scooby Doo right now, you know. But um, this video was a lot longer than I wanted it to be. But um, yeah, catch you guys later.